Hey guys, we're going to continue our lesson on stress. Today, it will be stress, the causes, and the effects. Again, stress is defined as how the body reacts to demands. And stresses are causes of stress. So, whatever it may be. School, uh, homework, projects, sports, um, outside of school. There's all kinds of different things that cause you to have stress. It is not impossible to live stress-free. There is always some type of stress going on. And it could be positive or negative, but there is always some type of stress going on. Managing stress in positive ways prepares us for increasing life changes. Stress, like I said, can be positive or negative. Uh, an example of you stress is getting nervous in anticipation of an important contest which motivates you to practice more. Some folks get nervous. I remember I used to get nervous before uh, every basketball game. Um, but I was anticipating to go out to do my best and to have fun. But like I said, I always had what they call butterflies in my stomach. An example of distress is forgetting an assignment because of feeling overwhelmed. And I'm sure a lot of you can attest to that. There are four types of stress. Threat, frustration, pressure, and conflict. Threat is the fear of being harmed, physically or emotionally. Examples are being afraid to walk home after dark. Or you're worried a friend will not invite you to an event, such as a party. Frustration. The ability to get needs met. An example, not able to complete an assignment because sister is using a computer or sibling, whatever that it may be. Or for the fact that uh, you just simply didn't have time because of extracurricular things going on. Pressure, having to measure up to an expectation or standard. Example, being expected to make the honor roll. And hopefully, um, mostly or all parents, um, they expect you to do your best and to try and make the honor roll. So some of you may feel pressure coming in those areas. Conflict, when two or more needs oppose each other. Example, a friend wanting you to go to the mall the same night as your gymnastics class. What are physical effects of stress? Stomach ache, sweating, pale complexion, headache, sleepiness, tight or sore muscles, rapid breathing, shaky hands. What are emotional effects of stress? Moodiness, loss of enthusiasm, forgetfulness, excessive worry, apathy, feeling overwhelmed, feeling short temper. Apathy or a feeling of being apathetic means that you lack interest or you lack the passion or emotion or excitement in some type of uh, event or an activity. An example of that is let's just say uh, you have a game or a gymnastics event or whatever that it may be and you just do not have uh, any enthusiasm or emotion or you just really do not want to participate in that event. That is a feeling of apathy or being apathetic. After you complete taking your notes, I would like for you to engage in an activity. Right now, individually with a partner or your group, I would like for you to brainstorm and come up with a list of stressors. Remember, stressors are things or items that cause stress. When you complete that individually, write a paragraph about what is stressing you out in your life. It can be positive or negative.